what up boys we back today and uh we are about to go ahead and sell some shoes again well we already sold the shoes we're about to ship out the shoes again and um it's gonna be the jordan one homage to home right here. So I'm just getting all the, the shipping labels ready to go, all packed up, and then we're going to bring it to the UPS store. And then we also have another book that we need to return. Uh, it's just a school book, so uh, yeah, let's go and get this packed up and ready to go. Alright boys, we got all the stuff packed up, ready to go. Um, we got to go ahead and get to that UPS store real quick, so um, yeah, it closes in maybe 25 minutes, but uh, luckily we have one that's uh, really close to us. Those robots. Um, yeah, so let's go ahead and go over there and um, we should be good. Alright, boys, we off on our way now. Um, we're gonna go ahead and just take the back roads real quick. Well, it's not really a back road, it's just not the main road because that main road is packed right now. It's about 6.30, right now, so it's basically 6.40 right now. Uh, I believe the UPS store closes at 7. It's definitely not going to be a fun time uh, going on the main road because, uh, yeah, no, no thank you. So I'm going to go ahead and go this back way real quick. And I will be over there. So the shoes that I sold, you know, I told you the Jordan 1 homage to home. Um, sold them for about $280. Yeah, and I'm going to go ahead and ship those out real quick. I also have another little textbook that I have uh, shipped out. Um, it was just a rental rental book uh, for, for school and stuff like that. So I'm going to send that out. All right, my boys, we went ahead and dropped off those shoes and the book. Um, we only made it here in about seven minutes. So uh, not bad, not bad at all. Alright boys, so since we did that, um, might as well go ahead and talk about a little, get a little update on the new car thing, um, definitely starting on the look already, um, even though I don't really plan on buying yet for another year maybe, but um, I did have the thought that um, maybe I shouldn't wait another year for this, uh, for me to buy this, because... Um, the longer I wait, the less valuable this car is going to be. The more I drive it, the less valuable this car is going to be. And uh, more chances of something happening to ruin its value possibly or something other like that. So um, I was just thinking maybe I could just sell it now. Um, maybe not so much now. But um, if I find a car, maybe I can definitely um, already have this car on the market and stuff like that. Um, you know, and try and sell it as soon as possible because if I do that, then I'll be able to get more for the car than I would be able to in a year's time because I mean, it's going to depreciate a little bit more. You know? So definitely thinking about that and. Um, I feel like that would probably be the better decision, but um, you know, I still gotta find the car first. So uh, I may have found, I found maybe a potential one, but uh, we're we'll gonna see about that one. Um, it, it looks very clean. It's a uh, 2013 model year for the Subaru BRZ, uh, so it's definitely not exactly that new. I mean, mine's 20, 2005. On the 2013, so it's about eight years different, so it's pretty big. But uh, the thing about that one, I believe it has 40,000 miles on it for 2013. That's you know not too bad at all. Um, so uh, I mean, it, it sounds like a good deal. Uh, the guy he's in a uh, he lives in the nicer area of um, the Bay Area. So he lives in Saratoga. I live in San Jose. Um, I go to school in Saratoga, and I, I know that area, and it's a nice area, <laughs> I can say that. Um, the car looks really nice, it's nice and clean, it's going to be like a charcoal gray color, or something of that sort, though. but um, 
Uh, still haven't contacted the guy yet. I still actually have to put this thing up for sale. Um, see what's going on for that. Um, so yeah, that's just pretty much what I'm thinking right now. Uh, so um, I'm thinking maybe I should buy the car sooner than later. And maybe I should sell this car that I'm in right now sooner than later. And potentially get more money for this car to put down on the next car. But um, the thing about doing that, there's only so much you can uh, use to negotiate in a deal when you have, you know, not all the cash up front. You probably want cash up front. And that car is about $17,000. And I'm looking to put 4000 down. So, you know, it's, it's a pretty good amount to put down. Also, I can also apply for a like a personal car loan, which um, which can definitely help. But anyhow, that was just a small little update, everybody. Other than that, I really don't have too much to say right now. Um, I'll go ahead and update you guys later. Alright, that's all for right now, boys. Um, unless I uh, have an update for you guys later today, um, that probably be it for today's vlog. Very short, very minimal. Um, just a little, real quick little drop off and uh, discussion real quick. Thanks for watching guys. Go ahead and uh, like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, definitely show some support in the comments for sure um, what I can improve on. I do have a mic coming on the way. Um, I did buy a mic, but unfortunately it, was, it wasn't, you know, quality. Um, yeah, sorry about that so far you guys, but um, for now. I'll go out and see you guys later. Peace out.